Fire signs have a reading for you today. Welcome back to the channel. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, add value to the channel so that we can continue to maneuver through these YouTube streets. So yeah, we have a message for you today. It was raining outside. We're back in the house doing some tarot messages for the time being. Can't wait till the sun come out. Fire signs, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. All right. Taking action towards something or someone is taking action towards you at this time. Grounding the reading today. Ace of Wands. So a new opportunity. New creative passions. Maybe even sexual encounters as well. This is your creativity at an all-time high or the universe providing you with some form of a creative abundance. Getting an aha moment here. But you're being guarded. You're being apprehensive about this new gift or this new opportunity coming in. This could be stress related. With it being nines. Um, some type of a karmic energy here. It's affecting you physically. Or affecting your spirituality. We see the bandage here on this person's head. It's like a wild animal backed up against a corner or backed up against a tree. Ace of Wands could be, uh, well, you're standing your energy. That is Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. And she's holding that one wand. She's ready to manifest. Some of the greatest talents comes from pain and sorrow. Ask any, any artist throughout history. You have spiritual protection, though. There's uh, the cat. Uh, getting a higher perspective, trying to help you manifest a new pathway in the background. Should have used a different camera. Eight of Cups has something to do with your emotions here. Or maybe people are watching you at this time, or they feel a certain way about you. Maybe they're guarded or have apprehensive about your artwork. Yeah, we have a bunch of people. Um, I'm not sure if this is an art studio. But we have people judging your artwork here. Mm, I'm not sure if you're ignoring them. We do know eights are about um, continuous effort, infinity. Ten of Pentacles. So if they're judging you, this is bringing attention. Uh, what do they say about press? Um... Good press or good press and bad press. <laughs> All press is good press. <laughs> so this could be people judging you, um, judging the works that you have done here is what I'm getting. This is an interesting message with the Ace of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles is my legacy card, my happy family, my multiple business opportunities and investments and whatnot. But it seems like you're being... Um, People are judging your your artistic work here. Hmm. You're manifesting some form of a um, some form of a self help library. I'm assuming, or these are the many different paintings and artworks that you have that's bringing bringing in abundance or finances. I'm getting doing things that other people are not willing to do to generate legacy for your lineage. Something that you're leaving behind for the family or for your people. It takes great strength. This is usually the, uh, <laughs> the selfish card. Nine of Swords. Unsure about what's going on here. Synchronicities. Nine of Swords and Nine of Wands. Something you may be losing sleep about or staying up late about. Hmm. Well, this is different. Normally, you would see uh, cats or crows um, in these pictures but we have a dove here in the window so there is a um, hmm there's an opportunity to gain freedom and release these negative thoughts from yourself 
It's going to take discernment here. You're going to be able to manifest your way out of this uh, negative energy. Yes. Ace of Cups, success. With the Ace of Wands, some type of new artistic endeavor or new creative passion that's bringing you a uh, wish fulfillment. Or some type of emotional success. Maybe, again, even sexual encounters. Partnership. Ten of Pentacles. Were you using... Hmm. The cup is overflowing here. With the Ace of Cups. Could be dealing with a drinker as well. And then we have the Doves again. Yeah, you're manifesting your way out of this situation here. You're manifesting partnership. Maybe even manifesting a family at this time. Or friendship. The Emperor. The Boss. Hmm. More Aries energy here. Fire sign energy, a creative, an entrepreneur, um, getting leadership qualities as well. Very sexually attractive individual, grounded, stable, able to think outside of the box, able to stand, huh, able to stand on top of the box is what I'm getting. Maybe on stage. This is how people are going to be looking at you as you're uh, performing this art as well. What other energies here for fire signs? At least you're standing in your energy here. Eight of Wands. You're continuously manifesting here. This could be some form of a road trip or travel. Eight of Wands typically symbolizes quick movement or communication or energies coming in towards you. Rapid communication. We're getting rapid change, rapid manifestation. Eight of Swords. Trapped in one's thoughts. Or being overwhelmed by the people. A lot of critics here. So synchronicities. Eight of Wands and Eight of Swords. writer's block am I getting or someone is trying to ostracize you or block you out of an industry or uh, block your manifestation they're just critics would you rather be <laughs> the sayer or would you rather be the doer Five of Wands, difficulties here. Someone is wanting to do battle with you or someone is less encouraged about the things that you're doing at this time. They're worrying about what you're doing. Oh, and the... So we have these witches arguing with each other about what ingredients to put into this pot here, the five of wands, but the pot is overflowing onto the ground and is about to burn up this whole situation here. So people are not attending to their own pursuits or their own ideals or actions at this time. People are not taking accountability and they're confusing the collective. Interesting read here, fire signs. Let's close out this reading here. Ace of Wands and Ace of Cups brings a new opportunity to um, getting performance art here for whatever reason. Um, people fall in love with your art, of course. People judge it. There's judgment here. This is you. And this is, could be how people are making you feel or how you're making people feel here. They're not understanding how to judge your creativity. But they do see you as a form of a leader or a boss. Some type of uh, creative initiative. Very guarded at this time with the Nine of Wands and Nine of Swords. Getting trapped communication here. I'm getting celebrity moments though. 
We have Eight of Cups. We have Ace of Cups. We have Ten of Pentacles, which is the finances that you're generating this time. It's like they can't stop your work for whatever reason. Or they're not understanding it. Maybe you could be bringing great illumination here. Ace of Pentacles, your work is giving people a giving people a different outlook on the things that they're typically or normally used to. But that's all for this reading here. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, add value to the channel. We'll be bringing more readings to the channel in the future. Stay positive, air signs. I'm sorry, fire signs. You could be dealing with an air sign. All of these uh, swords here. Communication is off. Maybe your thought process as well. Use great discernment. Peace.